is um, just showing you what I have in stock right now. Um, pretty much got the coffee, uh, pretty cheap. I got all this at Walmart, by the way. Um, ramen noodle, two six packs, a um, bunch of tuna, sardines, kipper snacks, um, which we call it herring. Um, chicken noodle soup with rice, peanut butter, chicken in the can, beans. Um, should have got more vegetables, but that's pretty much my stash right now that I have. But, um, yeah, these last for years, guys. Yeah, um, guys, wait. That was basically what I just got prepped for the coming SHTF. Um, what I'm trying to produce at, or have is my um, main diet is fish, beans, rice, vegetables, um, some meat, and I don't know, I just, I just like fish. Fish is good. It's good for you, good for your brain, um, need that, good, uh, vitamins, minerals, um, what else, like, just good for you pretty much, yeah. Although, why am I saying this when I'm smoking? <laughs> I don't really try to smoke that much anymore, but, um, hopefully gonna cut back and quit later on. Um, never good to go into SHTF if um if you have a drug addiction it's not so good um but yeah just prep everything in bulk go to Costco go to Sam's Club um I went to Walmart bought all that stuff um and uh oh yeah get your fishing gear I bought this like fishing pole I'll show you. Well, this is my brother's. It's like mine, but it's pretty short. Um, but it's made out of glass. As you can see here, it's very flexible. Um, it's pretty good. It's called a um, a dock demon. Pretty good fishing pole. Very lightweight. Um, can transport easily. Like it, you can see it's like three feet long. That's it. All right. And then, of course, get your fishing box right here. And maybe a light. You need light for trying to see in the dark and stuff like that. For night crawlers and bait. Um, also, thing that you can use is like hooks for hooks, like bones. You can use bones of an animal that you hunted. Um, sharpen it and then actually use it as a fishing hook. Um, maybe broken splinters of some sort from a tree, like bamboo. Um, you can sharpen that into a, a good fishing hook. Um, but yeah, um, prep your food. Get going on that, guys. Uh, we got a lot of work to do this year and thing is the government is not going to help you throughout the whole well the government they'll help you through things but when it comes to SHTF it's kind of like every man for himself kind of thing so just get going on um, all these prepper videos guys and I'll see you later peace later What is going on? I'm taking a drive down to uh, pretty much going to Virginia. Uh, gonna pay off the rest of the car today. Happy days, happy days. Uh, got my uh, return in and everything. So uh, gonna do that and then get an oil change. Um, might get inspected today, who knows? Cause I'm, I'm still on rejection, but um, I'll figure it out. Uh, but yeah guys, uh, always try to move to a secluded area and try to uh, actually like like get a uh, get a house like in the middle of nowhere. Uh, 
so you can be self-sustainable, raise chickens, raise crops, raise uh, cows, all that stuff. Start learning how to do farm and trade. Um, learn how to fix cars. Oh shit. <laughs> I had to stop real quick. Um, learn how to fix your own vehicles. Um, bulk up on gas. Bulk up on uh, fishing gear. Um, everybody's going to start hunting whenever SHTF happens. That's the one big thing, flaw. Um, so basically you gotta like get as much food as you can as possible, get seeds, um, start planting and growing in a greenhouse. Um, yeah, I mean, just gotta do it guys. Um, you can do it. I know I believe in you. Right now I'm in my car and I'm gonna use this as like my new home. Uh, I'm gonna probably go to Florida move more down south so I get the tropical climate weather. Um, yeah, it's really better there because uh, there's more light forms to actually, like, like you know, eat like fish and, uh, well, mainly I'm trying to get fish as my diet. Same with uh, rice, beans, uh, vegetables, all that stuff like that. Um, yeah, just like, um, um, that's why I'm moving to Florida, um, instead of when SHTF happens and I'm up in the north, then the snow's going to hit, nobody's going to be outside, nobody is going to be moving around, it's like a hibernation throughout all of winter, so, alright guys, uh, let's just be checking in with y'all, and I'll see you on the other side, peace.